Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you how to build this cool looking uh, medieval fancy tavern type thing. Uh, I hope you enjoy the video. We're nearly at 2,000 subs guys, so if, you've, if you want to help the channel please leave a like, subscribe, uh, leave a comment in the description below if you want me to do any more of these tutorials or like that and I'll get on it. Uh, thanks for watching and let's get on with the tutorial then. So we're going to start by p placing uh, these floors down. We're going to go two this way. And then we're going to have two this way as well. Like that. And what we're going to do is... Put a stone wall around the bottom of that. All the way around. So, just bits where you can see. I'm going to go all the way around with that stone wall. Obviously, it needs to put it back as well. Now, I think that these stone walls get a lot better texture than using these. So, what we're going to do is use a lot of these for this base. Uh, we're going to go up like this. Either side of this. And then we're going to put a small door in the middle. I think that gives a lot better effect, at least for this first floor anyway. So we'll follow it all the way around with, with these stones, with these little stone walls. Like that. We're going to have a door on that side as well. So I know it's a bit time consuming, but I do think it gives a lot better effect doing it like this. At least for this section of the build anyway. So we'll go out like that, guys. All the way around. Like right, so. And we'll put one more door at this side as well. I think that's his base floor done, guys. So that's part one to get to that that sort of progress. Now part two, guys, is going to be doing uh, the floor. Uh, we want it a bit offset so instead of it being like that we want it so it's sort of hanging outwards slightly which is difficult and uh, I found there probably is better ways to get it perfect centre but I've found just doing it uh, by free placing it uh, easiest way because we don't want it fully like that because that would be hanging out too much so we want it about half of that so if you go into free place mode pressing down on your d-pad and want it in the centre like that. Roughly about try and get it right on the corner. So we want it about there. Like that. And that is roughly where we want it guys So that's the second floor done, guys. We will be adding floor uh, steps and stairs and that in this after. Just wanted to get a general layout of that. So that's part two, anyway. So part three, guys. We'll be getting uh, as walls put up and as uh, starters tower. What we've got in the middle here. So we need to get that mapped out for where we're putting it. So for this tower, we want to get it. We're just going to put a square in there for now, like that. And 
that wants to be like the centre of his tower, so uh, we're going to free place again. And get it so it's about there like that. And then snap to that. And we'll get all six, like so, and so. Come on, I can get you. If you're having trouble, just delete that below it, and then uh, it should go in a bit easier. There we go. So once we've built that, guys what we need to do is start building those walls up. Now we will use stone walls for these because it gives it a bit better texture. Uh, and what we're going to do is put two stone walls like that and then one in the centre. square ones but that's not like that but there's no way that they were looking at uh probably ever put wooden ones in so we're gonna have to just go it's you know they look a little bit better i think so we'll, we'll go to them for now then we're gonna fill all this in as well yeah i want to thank the uh, channel members uh randy davis maxine Gooby, joe delts and yoga for continuing to support these years every month really appreciate you guys I'll be doing a base tour later as well. I've set up a new Discord, me and uh, Chris. So if you're ever on a base tour, do you know about that? Just give a shout on there, guys. You can find it in the description below. Uh, link to it. So we're going to have a chat over there with us. Uh, we do need some more windows in here, don't we? Actually, so I think we'll put we'll another window here. A window at this side. And one there. I don't like everything symmetrical anyway, guys. So I prefer it just. Uh, in fact, I'm, I will move that window down to, to there. Just to keep it the same as the other side. And then I think we'll do a couple of windows on this side as well. Like there. I wonder why they're not just open. That one is. That's weird. Hey. Uh, yeah, well, that's probably next stage done then, guys. That's stage three. Uh, then we'll start working on a roof and some other bits and pieces. So, let's get on with that. So, this is stage four, guys, doing roof and stuff. Uh, we do want the roof slightly overhanging like we've done with these down with this so what we'll do for this is we'll do the same as what we did on the bottom floor and we'll get one of these lined up uh, we'll make sure it's in line that way and then we'll go over about there and hopefully we've got that like bang on struggle to get this placed here guys I think what we'll do is just uh, delete that and that and then build them back in if I can sometimes you have to delete parts just and just come back to them 
big little uh, what's a big floor panel like this and go straight across. We'll have to put some more on there. There we go. Get one of these small ones and finish off down this side. Just like that. It gives it a better effect if you, if you have it a bit of volume like this. Uh, but just having it flush with walls below. You'll, you'll see what I mean once we start putting this roof on now, guys. So what we're going to do is uh, we'll go down to use this timber uh, roof. Panel, uh, not timber roof, sorry. Sloping timber roof, that's what we want. Uh, we're just going to put that on each side of this. I think actually what we have to do is get one of these, these and put this on each side. Like that. Just to start the roof off. And we'll need it on there and there. So one roof's going to go that way. Another roof's going to go that way. And they'll join up in the middle. Uh, so we want to get this now. This should just snap to the side of this and open. There we go. So it's going to be quite a steep roof, but that's what we want anyway. Uh, sometimes you just have to reposition your camera, guys, just to get a, a good snap point. There we go. So we're going to go keep coming up with these. Same with this one. That's it. I'll join in a bit of water. Look, look, there we go. Once it's all joined up. Uh, we're going to go down with this as well. It's going to be quite a tall roof, but I think that's what... Uh, it should be really for like a fantasy, medieval type, uh, type build. I'm going to go up with this. <coughs> Excuse me. We're actually going to put a corner piece here, guys. No, we're not. Uh, so I think what we'll do here, the best thing we could do is come to this edge. And wake up like this. So we'll keep building this roof all the way up, guys, like this. Uh, and push that point. <laughs> right, keep going up like this all the way to the top, guys. Uh, we're we're going to change back from what we're originally going to do. But uh, I've got an idea what we're doing now. So we're going straight across with this one. Like that. Straight across with this. And then we'll get this bit of weird shape at the end. But we'll put, a, we'll put like a window in there anyway to make it look good. Uh, or not a window, we'll just, we'll just block it off like this. That looks alright. But then on this end, we're going to have like a gable end coming out. Uh, I'm going to go down like that. I'm just going to put one more in below that one. I'm struggling now, aren't I? Uh, I'm just going to try and pre place it. Sometimes you just have to do stuff like that, guys. It looks alright anyway. So we'll go like that. Uh, but obviously, we need to put these in all the way up. Like that. There. Yeah. Oh, I didn't mean to place that one just a minute. There, there, there. Do the same on all sides like this. We've got some nice windows and stuff in, in these as well. Uh, yeah, there. Yeah. There. Yeah, I'm going to do more, more, more tutorials like this, guys. Uh, start doing them. Cause I know you, you lot like them. I haven't had much time, but when I do get time, I think I'll probably put a tutorial out every Monday. Uh, a new build tutorial like this. I'd obviously do it, my, uh, my base tours through week and stuff. And I, I know Chris will be doing his uh, micro builds and his, his other stuff he's got planned. He's got some good stuff coming up. So uh, be sure to hit that bell icon if you don't want to miss out on, on content, guys. Sometimes I have to go pick a different wall like this, just to be able to get them, uh, get them in, which is annoying, but... It always seems to happen with like, bigger builds. Uh, and we can free place it and make it look decent anyway, but obviously we'll have to free place this one. I'm just going to snap onto the side of that now. Right. We'll just go in and fill everything with mist, uh, like this. See if it's done the same with that one. It doesn't matter having to free play stuff every now and then, like. I think with this one, we'll do an extruded wall, but we'll do uh, some glass, just for a change. I'm going to struggle with this one as well, though. If we put them in first, maybe. Right. Yeah, we're going to have to free place that, but that doesn't matter. As long as we can get it looking decent. We just push it underneath, innit? Yeah, that looks decent. We'll keep it like that. So that's the main bit of roof done. We're going to have to extend this tower up uh, a bit more. We want a higher roof, so we'll go around like this. Uh, I think what we'll do is we'll delete that, that door there. Uh, 
kind of like the place on there. So we'll just put a full wall in there, like that. And then we can have another window near the top, I think. Uh, I think I'll space them out a bit better. We can have another window here. Like that. And this will block it off. I don't know if I'll make this tower accessible anyway, it'll probably just be for show, to be honest. Uh, right, so what we do need is uh, to do the roof of the tower. So we'll do that as his next part, part five, because it is, it's not a like, simple method or like that, so yeah, let's crack on with that. So part five, guys, uh, I'm going to try and find a better planet as well for my next uh, video, because it is a bit hazy, isn't it? Uh, find something with clear skies or something just so you can see a, a bit better, so I'll, I'll definitely do that for the next one. Uh, right, so we want to be adding these, but we don't want them at that angle so what we're going to have to do is uh rotate them and stuff like that so what i'm going to so guys like i said this roof here is going to be a little bit more difficult than than what else we've done uh so there's a bit of free placing involved and stuff like that so what we want to do is we want to get uh these and try and get them about halfway in between each uh so half of a of a like uh, of a hanging on outside, you know what I mean. So we're gonna go like this all the way round. Right, I wish we had uh, more parts so I could just make a roof easier like this. So these like uh, spike roofs. This is this is a decent way to do it really, unless you yeah, unless you use uh, I sometimes use them. I keep shrinking them down more and more. But for this for this build, I'm gonna try it this way uh, and see how it goes. I've not actually done this before, so I uh, I'm hoping it turns out alright. I think it should should work really. Uh, we want that better. One minute. So we'll uh, rotate it on that axis so we can see see it vertical like that. We can see that better then. Uh, and we'll turn it that way. So once we've got these on the side, this should give us a good angle for these uh, steps now. See how steep they are compared to just what you normally have, which is like that. It's like they've inverted them. So we're getting a good, uh, a good structure. Now once we've done that, we'd, what we want to do is delete these and do the corners. So we've got to delete these as well. So once you get the first one, others shouldn't be that difficult. So let's keep working around guys on these, uh, for one of these corners. They don't have to be proper perfect guys, but... Like that. I'm going to turn one of these on its side again. I'll take that away. And then so that you can just see that edge sticking out. I'm going to move that. <coughs> all these all the way around. I will speed the, speed these bits of the video up to be honest with you guys. 
Let's show you idea. That is snap points. It's just trying it out to uh, go with what it's over. Oh, it's a bar. I'm not bothered anyway. What we'll do is delete these, we'll delete them all, and then just build the wall up inside. Uh, from, from this wall, yeah. Oh, I think we missed one here, didn't we? Oh, we missed one at the roof. So we'll build this out again. Turn one on the side. Turn it away, the tree point. Like I thought I missed one. There we go. And what we'll do is just build this up inside it now. Like that. At least give it a bit of rag as well then. Like that. Now for the top of this, guys, what we're going to do is I'm not sure to be honest. Uh, I'm thinking of using something like I don't know, at least it needs to say like a wooden sort of look. So I think I'm trying to think like, how big these are. I don't think they're gonna be enough of this. Now I'll use that insulated flask rather than a little bit. Uh, what we got on here? I'll just use some pipe. A cylinder. Maybe it's a stone or wood. Mm. Stone I think. I'll just go like that and put a pipe on top of that. Uh, I don't know, do I? I think. I'm still kind of. I'm not really close, am I? Yeah, I think I'll stick with that one, just have it on this one, guys. Actually. Ah. Uh -huh. So that's that part done guys, that was probably the most strenuous part but uh, we've got to decorate the outside now so we'll get on with that. So I think we're on part six now aren't we guys, uh, now we've got this main structure done we can start adding some detail to outside before we start working on inside. Uh, so what we want is wooden timber walls like this what we're going to do is be doing a lot of free placing it's it's, it's wall uh wall b actually what we want i'm going to do a lot of free placing now so uh we're going to get these and put them vertical like that make sure that they're flush and get near enough as vertical as possible. I'm going to start in some bits of detail like this all the way around. Let's tap in. And it'll get that really good like uh, medieval fantasy vibe. These are bits I like doing most to be honest with you guys. Uh, all trimmings and stuff like that. But look, look how much better that just looks, just replacing them on. Let it be plain, you know what I mean? It's, it's so easy to add detail like that, and it just makes it look so much better. I'm going to do this on every side as well. So this is just for the start of this, guys. Uh, right, so we'll put one, uh, yeah, I'm just space them out properly. I'll we'll get that real. Yeah, that looks, that looks easy, this. I'll go back to the other one. Like I said, we'll do this all the way around and we'll be doing it on the tower as well. So, one, two, three, four. I think I was a bit 
Can you film in on it? I'll take that over here. Right, once that's done, look at that. That's just, so I hit it looking loads better. This is crazy how it can change a build like that. Right, let's start rotating something like this now. We want to make sure it's flush with the wall. So I went like that. In fact, what we're going to do is go put something in the, in the polygon there. The best way to do it is whack it to the thing. I don't know if to try and use a couple of them or not. Uh, now, I think we're going to stick with, with these, because they do get a bit better look for, for this build anyway. Uh, just going to go down and place these all the way around like this as well. Can't wait to start doing it inside, guys. But yeah, you should definitely use uh, stuff like this on your builds. These, uh, just to decorate outside, it's that old. All better texture. Uh, so we did it first with Castle Melvin's stone ones. Uh, turned out really well that. I will miss this corner off so I'll just nick one of them. Turn it that way. Actually looks like it's a bit coming forward, doesn't it? Right. <laughs> so annoying. Maybe we'll start again with that one. Sometimes it's easier just to start from scratch than uh, mess about trying to find that later angle. And we do need to add some up as a uh, up as tower to uh, In fact, I might just leak tower actually. Put some little ones across the front like this. Uh, what time are you going out there? Twelve. We'll be back for school. Take this one slightly. Uh, I will start again with that one. Right, I think I'll do for tower trimming this, guys. So that's basically the outside done. Oh, no, just before we do that, I want to add a couple of beams like to support this tower. So we're going to. Flip it that way, so it's flat, and then we're gonna flip it that way. I think it's gonna be harder than what I thought. Uh, so we're gonna spin it uh, like that. We'll put that just above the, uh, the top of the first stone wall, bottom like that. We'll just do one, two, probably a space of one in the middle, like that. And then what we're gonna do is get is a stone to the wall and attach these to the end of these ones, if we can. It's a little here. There we go. Like that. We're going to delete these. And add, add these to these. Just so they're not going inside. Like that. And that's some nice supports. For the for his tower. Like that. And I think... Oh. We just do this. Put some steps down from the front door. Especially this one. Where there's a gap. Like that. Probably not, not wooden ones actually. We'll go with stone. We can put some here as well. Even though we don't really need them. Like that. So that is the outside done, guys. Uh, I don't really think there's anything else we need to do, to be honest. Uh, and we're going to have a bit more decoration on the outside, but I think it's it's where it needs to be. So we'll, we'll leave it at that. In fact, what we could do is uh, get us wood. And just put a bit of decoration in here. Start again. A bit longer. Angle. So I'm going to do it a bit higher like that, so I can put another one in. On the same, on the opposite side like this. There we go. Just to get that bit of more effect. That. In fact, I'm not really bother with that, guys. We'll leave it. Sometimes less is more in it. Yeah, I think we'll go with that. I would like to add some of these up here, though. Uh, probably one of you. I wonder if we change the colour of these. Oh, they look good. Yeah, we're going to change the colour of all these guys to dark brown like this. Definitely. I like that. that that's a lot better colour for what we want. Oh, this what you can do is before you play something, you don't have to go down like a tip like me. I need to change them all. Uh, oh, I think that looks a loads better, that colour. We're going to give it that like, Victorian uh, medieval type look. Yeah, 
Jaa, se on tällainen atua. Öö. Hello, Hey, hello. Hey, hello. What's up, Mikael? And you're just going to do that all the way around like that. Yeah, that looks real now, that, guys. So that's us outside. Definitely finished now. Uh, and we'll move on to doing interior. So that's the exterior done. I think it's turned out really well, guys. It took me about about half an hour 40 minutes in total to do it so it should only take you about an hour if you watch this uh, follow all steps and that i think it was that that roof there took up most of the time really uh but not don't take that long to be honest with you uh to get it looking like this and you could put your own twists on it or whatever you want to do guys uh yeah let's get on with interior now then and uh work on this so we'll go in here I've deleted my little hut from outside because I can stand in here now and do it. Uh, let's go into first person as well. Like that. So we've got a nice space here. We are going to have to put some stairs up to the to top floor and stuff like that. So I think we'll... Uh, obviously you can do all interior however you want. Uh, this is just a, a little tutorial, guys, for anyone who wants to know how to make one. But... You could put your own twists on it or whatever you want to do. Uh, what we're going to do is... Build on here like this. This one's going to be a pain. I'll just replace that, guys. Uh, and then we can put some stairs in here. Like that. Uh, no, in fact, I think we'll spin them around, actually. Have them opposite way. If it's going to work now. Like that. Oh, I don't know. There we go. So that can be a stairs. Uh, I think we'll add a wall down the side of that. Like there. Just to block it off. Does that stick out from it, doesn't it? So I think we'll replace the wall. Just get a stone wall like this, flip it on its side, put it in this, uh, in this gap here, what's left. Like that. I think that's cool. So we've got access to this uh, first floor as well now, guys. We, we, we will have access to, uh, we'll actually build that now for this part of the build, actually. Do all floor layouts and stuff like that, so what we'll do is, we need to be able to get rid of some of it here. Like that. Uh, I think this would be a good place for the stairs to go down, actually. Yeah. So what we'll do is, uh, put these back. And put some more stone stairs. I think we should stick with stone, really. Uh, and then we can make all rooms and stuff as well. Let's uh, put some, uh, put a little wall around here as well. I always like to put walls around my staircases. Uh, that one's going to be awkward. I'll have to free place that one. So I don't mind free placing, but I'd rather not if I don't have to. Uh, so that's that sorted. We'll put a little one round here as well. Right, that's that done. Uh, I do think we need some handrails, to be honest, guys. So what we're going to use is the small timber wall, I think. You've got to free place these. Uh, so we want to tilt it that way. And get it so it's just about there. Yeah, so that's pretty bang on. If you've got it at the angle, you can just join on to edge of this. But if you hadn't, it'll start like clipping in by the time it gets to the top. But that looks pretty spot on anyway. 
Uh, we'll do the same with this side. I'll make sure that we get it in line with the other one. So it's just about the, the, the uh, ish, I think. Yeah, that's pretty spot on that, guys. And we'll, uh, we'll do the same with this. We'll just put the one on that side. Uh, if that comes around here, I can get a better angle on it. There. Right, that's cool. Nice. You could always add another one at the bottom like that. I think everything will go with that as well. Uh, so. There we go. And then we'll just finish it off with a little one here. On the ends. I think that's the staircase is done. We'll do rooms as well. This part this could be like a general construction uh, part what we're doing. Uh, there and there. I think that's that done, guys. Uh, you can always have these running into the stairs like that. Uh, probably not with the top one because uh, it's only coming out of it. We can top it off like that though. We'll, we'll leave that for now, I think it's about that. Uh, so this, this downstairs bit, we want it more like a... This is his entrance, and then we want to go upstairs to the bar, and have this as like a cellar, don't we, I think. So I think what we'll do is we'll block this off, uh, still using stone walls. And we'll put in a, a door here, I think. And then a, a wall. And we'll have this so it's like two parts, isn't it? I think that'll be a better way to go with it. Uh, if we can get this to snap. Might have a little door here as well, in fact. Nice. Uh, I do think we do need wood on the uh, inside to make the the inside look good. We'll, we'll work on these uh, rooms on top floor because these, these are going to have to be like bedrooms, stuff like that. So what we'll do is we'll get some uh, stone walls and we'll separate most of this off. Uh, yeah, I, I couldn't get to grips with what I wanted to do then. But it's all good. Uh, right, let's... We want this like a hallway, so it's going to be really hard to snap now. That's only problem. Uh, we've got a minute. So if we have that like a hallway there, uh, then we can have bedrooms coming off here, can't we? If it wants to come all the way down like this, then we can put one of these uh, roof things in here, like that, to block that off. We'll have to do that all the way up actually. We'll have to get his walls. Uh, like that. Yeah, I think that looks pretty good actually. Uh, shall we block that off or not? I think we should actually. I think we should. So we'll block that and then put one wall here. And if we can get a snap point, it's getting really hard now, guys. Uh, oh, I had it. There we go. Now these can go straight up, can't they? Uh, especially just for this side. And then I'll have to put one of them things. One of these in. Oh, that's been awkward. Free place again. That's his hallway. We definitely need to put some uh, weird door in here, don't we? No, sir. This could be like the main main bedroom. Uh, I wish we could get rid of these bits. I suppose if we put a wall somewhere, this is going to be hard to snap. Put a wall there and a wall uh, there. Just to get rid of these bits, you know. Can't be able to put a wall there, can I can put it half? Like that, and then block them off with uh, with these. Yeah, that looks, that looks alright actually. Uh, just tidied it all up a bit, guys. Uh, I reckon I'm gonna end up spending as much time on the interior as I did on the exterior, to be honest. So it's probably like a couple of hour build, really. Which, which isn't much, is really. Great, great scheme of things. I know people spend like 20 hours on builds, stuff like that. More, in fact. So I think a couple of hours to get some sort of looking uh, half decent like this is not bad. Yeah, I think uh, it's all blocked off now. Oh, we need to build that up, don't we? But yeah, I think that's cool. Uh, I think we, we'll probably just have one room real, can we? So I think what we'll do is make this into a room as well at the end. Uh, so maybe we could get rid of that wall and that wall. And if this is a little room, I think that'd be a good idea. Uh, single wall like that. Gable ends. Here we go. 
いやなんか機関車を呼んだそうなんでしょううんいやだめだシングルシットはねはいファスターそうだこれは中間集合じゃないえこれはさあちょっとメニューを見せますねえ行きましょうあ、uh, I don't know why it did that. Let me go down and get get it again. Uh, ah, that's it. Good. You gotta make sure you ain't got you ain't got snap play songs. It'll try and uh, snap to things as as you're moving around. So I do think we'll put some of these on inside. It'll get that nice uh, nice look. Probably not as many as outside, but we'll. Uh So that's all the inside, uh, inside building work done. And I think it's looking pretty good. So we'll crack on with decorating and stuff like that. Oh, what I do do want to want to do for this section, guys, is actually make a entrance for tower as well. I forgot, I forgot about that. Uh, so we can actually see tower here, uh, and we're just we're just gonna put a simple uh, door in. Delete this. Uh, put a door. In there, and we're actually going to have some uh, some ladders going up, so we can delete that I think, and that. Uh, so we'd have to have ladders going up that side, which is a bit window side. Which is not ideal, but it is what it is. Uh, so we'll actually put some ladders in these ones, free place. And we'll just have these going straight up here. Like I said, it's not ideal, guys, but it's uh, it's what we've got. Uh, Actually, glitch these into each other like this to get this right height. It should be enough room to get through that one, ladders, I think. Let's try it. Hopefully, it does. Yes. Yes, it worked. I've got this little ledge here. Nice. I'm glad that worked. So what, we'll, what we'll do that is uh, we'll put another ladder in this one. Make sure it still works like that, we can get up and down it. Right, that's great. Nice. Oh, we don't want that, actually. There we go. And we can go back down it. Yay! So that's definitely interior done now guys, the construction part of it. So let's move on to decorating the downstairs. 
So we're going to stick with like the medieval tavern look, guys. Uh, let's put a bit of decoration on outside. So we want one of them flags, I think. Uh, where are they? These hanging flags. These look good. I think we need one of these on outside of his tavern, definitely. Uh, having a bit of clipping issues here, guys. So what we'll do is just put one, and then we'll put one onto that, and then delete the first one. And that should stick out right there, then. Like that. Yeah, that looks nice. We will add some more flags and stuff after. Uh, so Right, that's that bit done then guys, let's move on to upstairs part of the bar. So what I'm going to do guys, because the video is like over the other uh, an hour long, so I'm just going to like show you around inside after I've uh, decorated it, so uh, let's go and have a look at that. So this is uh, your entrance with little uh, reception desk and that, we've got downstairs toilets here. Let's just put a wheelbarrow for a thing there, we've got a piss tray. Uh, I think these turned out alright, these little sinks. Uh, I, like, I like them. They're just like two light tables. With, uh, with taps on and that. Yeah, it turned out alright. I, I love this kitchen, what I've done. Uh, it's pretty basic, but I just uh, I like it with you know, all storage room and stuff like that. Yeah, it turned out really well. I just put my torch on. So yeah, we've got this little storage room and that. Got loads of different food, stuff like that. Yeah. Couple of posters on the wall and that. Sink. And then we can go upstairs to the main bar. Well, this beautiful fireplace and stuff with Amino Hub logo above. This is located in Amino Hub region, so I thought we'd... Uh, I always build the bases at at this hub. So we've got a nice bar area here and that. Yeah, I, I wait, I'm not going to do uh, show you my building there, I just wanted to show you when it's finished. A nice little planter at the back with some trees and that in. And these like booths for dining and stuff like that. Got some round tables as well. Nice lighting. I put these uh, these rugs at the top of each window as well, I thought it gave it a nice a nice look to it. Uh, we've obviously got a tower in here, I haven't done that up there yet, I might do some of them. Uh, upstairs, I haven't done, they're just going to be standard bedrooms really, so I'll just leave that down to whatever you want to put in yourselves. Uh, we've got a lovely view as well from these bedrooms. But yeah, that's about it guys, uh, thanks for watching, thank you so much if you watched our video, that's dedication for you that, uh, it, I didn't know it was going to be this long but I've tried to keep it down as much as possible, uh, if this video has been an help to you please help channel out, uh, return favour and leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already guys, uh, hit that bell notification for more videos every day and we'll see you on the next one, thanks, bye. Oh yeah, I'll uh, do a proper video tour of this base at some point. I'll get Chris to come and do one. So with me. So see you soon, guys. Cheers.